Yo guys, it's up, Soulfied, and welcome back to the newest video. Well, as you guys can tell by the title, I have quite a story for you. First of all, unlike the other video, I'm gonna try to play a game and actually find one for once. I've also decided to fully embrace my randomness and throw in whatever I say in the video. Also pointing out one thing, got my hair cut. It looks a little, little different, not as long on top. I gotta take a second to point out my flaws so no one else does because I fully embrace them. So, gonna say it now. I have like a bald spot, I don't know where that came from. I also have like this weird mole. Also, I just have a weird head. I look weird. Anyways, that's done, let's find a game and get straight into talking about all of the randomness that I have in my life. Oh, and I also have chips. Hold on. Pringles, French onion dip, I forgot for a second what I had. I'm gonna do uh, ASMR. That made everybody in my game leave too. And Plaza. Always starting off with the bad maps. Please vote random. Two. Two votes. Oh, three. Four? What's it gonna be? Rush, I'll take it. I'll take that. Alright, so, before I get into this, this story happened on Snapchat. So, I'm not gonna disclose the guy's name because he's probably gonna see this. Actually, I'm gonna block him after this. I need to block this dude. If you guys wanna add me on Snapchat, it's gonna be popping up right... Here? There. There. Somewhere in that area. Maybe that area. Maybe this area. I don't... I don't know. It's gonna be on the screen. Okay, I'll lay the background for you guys. I was trying to be a normal teenager like every other day. Just go about my business, doing my designs and everything. Why did that guy concuss me? My rating host. I'm not gonna say his Snapchat name, like the actual username, but his name on there was NASA. And because I'm stupid sometimes, I instantly thought for a second, NASA messaged me on Snapchat? What is going on? So I checked, I had six messages from this dude. Six messages on Snapchat from NASA. Oh, also, hopefully my webcam doesn't freeze. If it does, I'm gonna have to go over here, click record, and start over again. Don't make me leave Black Ops 2, I'll do it. I swear, I'll go back to Meat Boy. I don't even care. <sighs> I'll play it, I'll play it. It's a game, there's a lobby. It'll it'll be done, please bear with me. Or I even leave off. VO2 and its crappy connection and maps is just... I can't, I can't stay focused. Oh yeah, check the messages. Evidently Snapchat had my birthday as the 9th, and this is probably going up on the 10th when my birthday is, so my birthday is today. It's weird saying that a day early, but the day this goes up, it's my birthday. Big ol' 19, 19, a year older than 18, 1 plus 18 is, uh, is 19. My math's good there. Don't ask Noah if, about my math because that's a problem and I can't talk and play at the same time. Alright, we'll play this game, we'll play this game. I'm gonna sit here and kind of, uh, review my story again. Snapchat, guy named NASA, go by, goes by NASA, messaged me six times on what he thought was my birthday and said happy birthday, then proceeded to show me this picture. That. That in his hand? He offered me something called MD, I think, is which is basically ecstasy. This man offered me ecstasy on Snapchat under the name of NASA. Gotta wrap this up before my webcam decides to freeze again. Dude, get off the crap! Get off the ground! He sent me that picture, then sent me a picture of a gummy bear made out of ecstasy? Didn't know that was a thing. So I proceeded to ask him, of course, why? Why would you offer some random dude on Snapchat this? And he he brings up the fact, and I kind of understand this, where he's like, I, you know, you gotta do something, you gotta grind for money. I understand needing to grind for money, but not like that, man. Jeez, find something better. Play Black Ops 2 professionally with a pistol that has a silencer? Oh, dude. Yeah, this entire game is a bust. Yeah, I'm just gonna leave it. I don't like that map. Guess we're gonna follow the trend of playing Meat Boy in my videos after trying Call of Duty because nothing wants to work. So, uh... At this point, if you came to watch Call of Duty, I'm sorry. I'm finishing out the Ecstasy Snapchat NASA story in Meat Boy. I'm coming up on the uh, 10 minute 30 second mark on my webcam. It froze about 12 minutes in, so I might be able to get two minutes of uh, Meat Boy before it decides to freeze again. Oh, this is where I got stuck last time and everything froze. See if it, <laughs> see if it does it again. Oh, I actually just zoomed straight through that level. All right. Yeah, if my webcam web cram if my webcam doesn't end up freezing at some point during this like this level or just this game in general I'm gonna be surprised 
The dude's answer for the reason he was messaging me was that whole money thing. Plus, he just said he sells over Snapchat. I don't understand if he just, like, mails it. How do you mail ecstasy? Isn't that, like, illegal in most places? Evidently, it's a big thing in the UK where this dude's from because if you can make it into gummy bears, it's gotta be a big thing. Gummy bears, you don't just make anything out of gummy bears. I, of course, proceeded to be the good guy. The little goody two-shoes that I am, evidently. And, uh, tell this dude, hey, it's illegal. Don't, don't. No thanks. And... He wasn't, he wasn't too happy. He wasn't too happy. I find it funny that some random drug dealer dude says happy birthday to me. One, when it's not my birthday. And two, proceeds to right after offer me drugs. He doesn't know where I live, my name, my age, anything. And he offers me ecstasy. Pretend that we're meeting for the first time. Hi, I'm Tyler. What's your name? Oh, really? Wow, that's nice. Do you want some ecstasy? It's great. Makes you feel love like never before. That's what he said. It makes you feel a love like nothing else. If something's not gonna make me feel good by myself as a human, eh, no thanks. It's not It's not my cup of tea. Unless it's a cup of tea. That makes me feel pretty good. I like some tea. This fan is, this fan blows. I know that anybody that knows me in person, if they see me making crappy jokes, it's gonna get brought up. The amount of times, the one time I did the, I'm not even gonna do it. I almost did it. I'm. You might've caught it. The Italian hand. It's a running joke. It's That's all it is. It's a running joke. I, I'm zooming here. That was the easiest level I've ever played. Oh, no, never mind. I think this one might be. Yeah, I'm I'm pretty all right. Oh, I lied. There, there, this one level is one that I could speed run so well, like back whenever I actually did this game quite a bit. That's pretty much it to the ecstasy thing. This dude just offered me ecstasy randomly on Snapchat. And I told him it's illegal in the United States, and he was just like, I don't care. There we go. And mid burp. Oof. Now, I was planning on doing a Q&A today, and I'm going to throw up two questions that I got asked. Of course, since I'm not a huge YouTuber, I didn't get a ton of questions, but I'm going to throw them up on screen. These are the ones that got asked. Whoever asked them, you got lucky because I'm throwing them in. All right, we got one from, he says... Hashtag ask Stolify. This isn't a question. I'm just telling you that I respect you and cherish your existence. Happy day of birth, deadass. Thanks, dude. Glad you appreciate my birth. I'm making YouTube videos with it. Colton asks, hashtag ask Stolified, what is your main motivation for working out? What's the end goal? Motivation is kind of one of those things where it took me years, literally years to come up with the thing that finally made it click. And what that is, is I'm getting older, I don't want to be in my 20s or 30s or whatever, and just have my body failing me. Why would, why would anybody want that? I want to be able to look good, feel good, and just like, actually not be afraid to take my shirt off at events that it's like, I don't know, going to a pool, or if it's hot outside, I'll be able to take my shirt off, I don't want to sit there and sweat. I want to look good, one, for just my confidence, but two, I mean... I'm single, I gotta find a chick somehow, and for the past 19 years hasn't worked, but you know, I didn't come out of the womb looking for a chick. Let's see if my webcam's still recording. Yeah, no. Oh, we're 17 minutes in. This is a new record, guys. Everything's working. I'm surprised. Well, this video is gonna consist of the ecstasy story, the two questions I got asked, and uh, a little update. So, you guys are seeing this on the 10th, and on the 14th I have something planned. If you guys don't follow me on Twitter, make sure you go check out- I just made that jump, oh my gosh. Whew. If you guys don't already follow me on Twitter, like I had earlier, my Snapchat and my Twitter popped up. Feel free to go follow those. I tweeted something two days ago, I think it was, about plans that I had from the 14th up until about early October. So, my grandparents recently got an RV. They live decently close to me. And they're going to be tripping. That sounds terrible after I just said ecstasy. Oh lord. They're gonna be going on a road trip in their RV and I'm gonna be house sitting. I came up with this thing in my head. It was kind of a plan. I it wasn't anything I was gonna follow. It was just kind of like a nice idea. I thought the key was right there, but I was wrong and I'm dead. I thought of the idea of taking my entire setup over to my grand <sighs> taking my entire setup over to my grandparents, I'm going to keep dying, why am I stupid? So I could make videos and record and do all that stuff while I was there. Their internet is way better than mine, 
It actually happened. I talked to my grandma and she said that I could bring all my stuff. So I'm gonna have a setup basically in their living room on the dining table with my Mac and everything. Living there for a couple of weeks. Their internet is really good. If you guys want to know comparison, mine is about 2.6 download and my upload is 0 0.6. 0 0.6. If you guys know anything about internet, that sucks. Even if... <laughs> Even if you don't know anything about internet, the fact that it's a point something is bad enough. So, of course, I checked my grandparents' internet while I was there to see the speed. It's five to six both ways. I'm going to die. And I'm going to be able to stream. So, I'm actually planning on revamping my Twitch that I have right now. I'm not going to talk about the link or anything because it just looks like trash. And I really want to be able to, you know look decent whenever I start. I'm gonna try to get my Twitch channel set up, that way I can stream while I'm there. And the first thing that I wanna do, I know it sucks to bring up money in any situation, but seeing I currently don't have a job and I'm trying to do YouTube, I'm gonna have to try to find some way to fund this. So my plan right now is to, if I get any donations, it's gonna go straight, oh, there's a blade. It's gonna go straight to funding my purchase of World War II. I wanna make videos on it for you guys, and if I do that, I just jump straight into a laser. If I can stream to a point where like, I get a little bit of money, enough to be able to at least cover part of my purchase for World War II, I'll see if I can find money some other way. But if any of you guys would like to help with that, that would be amazing. I'm doing pretty good so far on the whole YouTube thing. It's not- oh, I'm gonna die. Oof. It's not a everyday situation right now. Until I figure it out with my schedule, it's not going to be. But I'm trying to work it in. As long as I can come up with YouTube video ideas, then things will be good. I got a couple written down, and they're not really gaming related. Just kind of stuff I would talk about. If you guys want to see videos of just me sitting down talking about these things, let me know. Or if you got- if the overwhelming majority of my viewers are gamers, I'll just sit and kind of talk about it in the video and while I'm playing something in the background. I mean, we've already seen me try to play Black Ops 2 twice, that didn't work, so uh, I guess the next video we're gonna try again. We're gonna try again and um, hopefully it works. We'll see what happens. I think that's gonna be it for this video though, guys. Hopefully you enjoyed. Weird ecstasy story that it just happened, like, this week. Answered two questions and talked about an upcoming update, so this video seems pretty chock full of random stuff, so uh, yeah, I think that's gonna be it. If you guys enjoyed, please like, favorite, comment, subscribe, go down below, hit that subscription, as well as the notification bell so you guys stay updated on all the videos I'm posting. And as always, I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.